Hello guys, it's Apple, and um, pretty good news this week. I would like to start with my Hilda. So uh, we're going to take Hilda to six stars. Um, I hate to say it, but Hilda... Uh, I like Hilda more than uh, Vargas. I knew this was going to happen, <laughs> but... Uh, I, I feel bad, but uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I like Hilda more than Vargas. There's just so much more she can do in battle. It's kind of scary uh, how good Hilda has become. Like, let me show you. I, I'm ranked pretty high. I'm like 33 now. I knew I would like make a huge jump once I hit on. Uh, this is like, this is like my freaking uh, guild um, leader. He is so strong. Masayan. I don't know why he said made his name. It's it's a I don't know. I'm not gonna judge him, but come on, dude. Uh, I like your name, uh, Masayan. I like that name more. He's like a super hardcore PvP player. Him and Trisket. <laughs> she's like uh, my um, the other one. She's like a vice leader. So yeah, she's up there too in power. I'm like 33 behind them. Look, look at Zanshin and all the other like Urzen, Kaladi, No More Pity, please. Yeah, all of them. Kongwen. Obviously, his end chance might be like way better than mine. Yeah. <laughs> 10 HP, that's ridiculous. That's insane. No wonder his, his power is so high. 10 HP, no way. 15 HP, well, that'll do it. Yeah, there's no, uh, yeah, that'll do it. That'll do it. Juni, Overlord, Manga. Yeah, Robin, the Dervisher. Crusher, Nader, Just Lambda. So yeah, most of these guys above me are like super, uh, super wells and uh, YouTubers and whatnot. So I'm in good company. I'm in real good company. Besides, uh, there's a reason why my power is so low. Cause there's no HP on my weapon. Um, this is this is my mistake. I, I just wanted the extra stats. I actually had more HP on that, but I took it off. I have HP here 11. And I have like 4 HP, so my power is like, could be a lot higher. And uh, let, let me see, which soldiers are stronger? I use crystal molders more now, now that I have, now that I have them at, uh, at level 10. So, I use, I even use uh, crystal molders over stone colossus. Um, Cause you, you get HP restoration, so that's really cool. And, when she fights uh, wizards, she's like, she like um, she has an advantage. Like when she fights wizards, reflects thirty percent of the damage, which is really good against uh, Tensei Jessica. So. But anyways, like there's ways to increase her power. My um, legend's power is like ultra high because of the true training. So I'll go into that a little later. So yeah, that, I, I'm I'm really satisfied with Hilda. In fact. I, I feel bad because now I don't want to invest any resources into my Vargas. I mean, he's good enough as is. I mean, the stats are okay. Um, uh, even his class training is decent. I mean, above decent, really. Um, oh, I need to max that out. And, uh, his defense, I could probably max out right now, but I won't do that. I'm going to dump all my resources into Hilda. She's my favorite tank now. Uh, she's actually taking the spot of my favorite tank. Yeah, yeah, she's, she's really up there now. I hate to say that, I feel bad, but uh, it's just the way things go. But anyways, uh, moving on, I actually have been putting resources into my uh, Almeida. I actually like playing Almeida. Um, she's, a, she's a 40 in equipment. Her class and chance are meh, because that should be 80. And her magic defense is trash. I shouldn't even invest into it, but I shouldn't even really invest into her magic defense since it's already naturally high. I should I should dump that on uh, static defense. So, uh, and she's part of a uh, Mythic Realm faction, and I'm only missing three units from Mythic Realm. This guy like broke my heart because I, I tried to summon for him and I summoned for him, and 
and I got an extra copy of this douchebag, and I didn't want that. Um, but my Giz is coming along just fine. Uh, Giz is coming along just fine. He's actually pretty strong. Um, this his magic is is like not that great because uh, he's not in his demon form. But uh, I think it's better for him to stay as a wizard. I mean, he's ranked pretty high. I keep rank, showing his rank, but, uh... Wow, sweet Dango. I mean, wow, good job, dude. But he's demon, but, um, yeah. His rolls come on just fine, as far as things go. My, um, Ultra Mueller is coming on just fine as well. Let's go into PvP real quick. We're off-season right now. And I bet it. I bet on Luxit, and he won. I'm gonna actually have to show you these matches of Luxit, the championship match, because the last match I actually predicted most of his moves. I actually saw the strategy that he was coming up with, and I like, yeah, this is the strategy that you should use to win. So it shows I'm becoming a better PvP player because Lux Luxit is way out of my league. For me to even like be able to read some of his moves is it's kind of good, but um. In his defense, it, it was such a clear clutch, um, clear cut strategy that uh, it wasn't that hard to read. But the fact that he used it really excited me. The fact that I was like, "Yeah, you should move your guy here," you should, and he just won. It's really good. That was a really good um, match. I, I'm really glad I got to see that. I actually saw it live, so that was really fun. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm getting ready for PvP as well. As far as uh, uh, my uh, regular content goes, um, I've done almost most of them. I'm only missing two here now. Uh, this one, which has been a struggle for me, and uh, this one I just didn't want to do because it's kind of mentally exhausting. I still have these three to go, so I'm not worried about it. As far as uh, Sokai's Rainbow, this this is boring me now because I. I I beat the um, last, last challenge, so I'm, I'm kind of bored of it. I had no motivation to get some of this stuff. I, I know I gotta get that. I, I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get that. And, uh, and I'm gonna get this. I'm, I'm, I may, I'm not even gonna get the keys, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not, I'm not even gonna mess with this. Um, I'm just gonna get this. And uh, get this. And, uh, get that. And, uh, I'm done. Uh, I mean, I, I think like it was a good one, but I just hate the rewards that they gave you. So I'm like not motivated. So let's go into my bonds real quick. I just wasn't motivated to do it. Uh, Hilda is finished now, so I finished Hilda. So now I'm gonna start on Licorice, because I think Licorice is actually a good um, long-term unit. Because her playstyle is so unique that it makes her long-term viable. And once she gets her exclusive, I mean, she's, she can actually be your healer. And I'm, and I'm putting charge into my uh, Giz. Um, I actually like playing Giz. I know I don't show like videos of playing Giz because I'm an Empire player, but I do like playing Giz. Giz is actually a fun character to play. Uh, I actually am starting to like him a lot more. My Ultimate Mueller. Um, since his SP form, I started playing him, and I realized he's like, he's kind of like Owen, but he doesn't have self-healing. He hits hard, and he takes hits really well. He's pretty much a duelist, but I, I hate the fact that he doesn't have healing outside of reinforcements. If he had a better healing mechanic, that would be good, so I'm kind of motivated to actually um, build bats for him, since in the Chin server, they use bats on him, so <laughs> it is what it is. Where's my Himiko at? She's up. She's somewhere. There goes Himiko. Um, actually, haven't done anything with her bonds. I haven't even touched them, dude. I, I did this because that was really easy, but I, I haven't touched her bonds. I just been dumping charges for her. Um, yeah, we're at four stars with her, and we'll we'll get to um, five stars. Not before like, the next season starts, unfortunately. But hey, it is what it is. Who else I've been messing with? I've actually been messing with this dude. I hate to say it, but I'm a big fan of Clotair. And I've been dumping my free shards into him. So, uh, yes, yeah, so I can at least get him to five stars. I, I would like to get him to six stars. I'm, I'm actually a big fan of Clotair. I hate to say it, but I am. 
it's just I just don't I just don't feel comfortable playing with him at uh, four stars. I know that I can't play him at four stars. I have played him at four stars and clear content with him, but I, I would like to get him to six stars as well as her. Um, I think she becomes alive at six stars, and her exclusive equipment is really good. And where are we at on training? Uh, that's that'd be the last part of training. Yeah, I haven't done anything here. Um, Lance, my Lancer training. I maxed out my um, Crystal Motors, of course, and uh, I'm actually gonna like max this out. Uh, Lancer troops are gonna be like really big, so I'm gonna max this out and um, I'm gonna max out Hot Lights, but I'm gonna max out this first. Uh, and I'm gonna start uh, doing the rest. I actually have a lot of resources in between my troops and uh, spears. I'm doing really good in there. I actually have to finish what I started here. Um, I just got sidetracked. I actually want to build this troop for Bernie, but uh, he's like low priority. I actually need to finish up these, uh, these, um, freaking, uh, uh, nodes. Is that because once I do that, all I have to do is uh, this. And I actually really need to do that. Because uh, the horse troops are still useful in the meta. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm focused on finishing up these uh, bishops. Because uh, tomorrow I should have bishops done. Because they're kind of essential. Because if you look at it, um, she uses them. She really needs bishops. She uses bishops really well. Because, um,. They're, they're a meat tank, because like they, when their HP is really high, their defense is increased by uh, 30%. I mean, they're not as good as Shrine Maidens, but she like, she can't get Shrine Maidens. It sucks. She really could use Shrine Maidens. Uh, he gets Shrine Maidens, and she does not get Shrine Maidens. I don't know why she doesn't get Shrine Maidens. Her HP is so low. And um, if you see that battle between Luxit and... Um, Fresh Prince, you'll realize that uh, that is a big weakness because Ares was able to one-shot her easily. So yeah, if, yeah, it sucks, man. That, that they can't, she can't get Shrine Maidens. <laughs> it really sucks. Um, I think Shrine Maidens are one of the best troops in the game because when your soldier HP is at 100%, I mean, the physical damage you take is decreased by 75%. That's that's clutch, man. I mean. Uh, only seven people get a shrine meat. That is so garbo. Uh, I know that this is a rare treat. And um, one, two, three, four. Four of the people that uh, get them are SSR units. So it shows you how powerful shrine meats are. I doubt they will expand the shrine meats that much. Yeah, it is what it is. But it's fine. We have to. You have to balance the game out somehow. Anyways, guys, if you like my content, the like, share, subscribe button. I'll get back to you. Have a great day. And goodbye.